I just have a DGN open. I have a couple utility nodes and conduits and a couple drainage nodes and conduits. So I'm just going to open up the utility properties for this node here. So if I go to the utility properties, um, this is the, the field that existed before the MicroStation 3D ID. And so this is the new field, um, the MicroStation 2D ID. So we have two different IDs here. Um, so this exists for nodes and conduits. Um, and it also exists on the pseudo database or the drainage database. So if I open up the drainage properties for a stormwater node, for instance, I can go to the drainage tab and underneath general, I have the same two fields, uh, MicroStation 3D ID and MicroStation 2D ID. I can um, verify that it's correct by going to the home tab, going under primary and then clicking down here on details. So if I select this node here and I scroll down in the details till I find the element ID. The element ID is 1632 and that matches up with the 2D ID. If I open up the 3D view, I can show that that's correct too. So I'm just going to select the same node that I selected before. And then scroll over to the element ID and this says 1631 and this says 1631. I think it's worth noting that any DGNs prior to or equal to 1091 will have these fields populated when it's opened. 